pulling for the underdog. Uh, the impossible can happen. The impossible dream, and that was it. We were 100 to 1 odds. So how could it not take you by storm? How could it not, you know, shake you to your soul and say, how in the world can these 25 individuals, how could they get it done? Well, I think Baltimore is uh, uh, way ahead of the Mets, uh, I think, but Baltimore has a far better ball club. I think it's going to be awfully difficult for the Mets to win. That particular ball, I, I wasn't sure. I just took off running that ball. And, uh, you know, and in my mind, when I took off the ball, I knew it was the World Series. And I said that if I got to run through the wall to catch this ball, I said I'm running right through the wall. And when I took off after that, I never thought about anything else but catching the ball. To make that catch in a World Series, to have you know guys like Willie Mays and Mickey Mantle when he was alive say he thought that was one of the greatest catches he ever saw in a World Series, it's a fulfillment of, uh, of whatever I was or was not as a baseball player. Um, it's nice to know that, that you, did, you left some tracks uh, in the sand that remain. When nobody wants to bunt, who wants to come in the World Series? Everybody's walk, watching back home. Uh, the whole world's watching. Who wants to bunt? Well, I it's like a dream, you know, playing ball then a '69 in New York. Uh, just I, I look back now and I, yeah, I really did play there. I mean, but it's just like it went so quickly that I wasn't even there. But I'm sure glad I was. <laughs>